finally it's finally. back we're back in we're action back. lots going on already in 2022 yep. you have a couple of projects on the go a flagship project well, we, we have 12 projects on the go, and, and certainly the excitement in uranium over the last year or so has allowed us to get back to a lot of those projects, but there's a couple in particular that we, we do focus on. One is a joint venture we have with Cameco and Arano. It's called Hook Lake. It's on the west side of, of uh, the Athabasca Basin, which is in northern Saskatchewan, where all of Canada's uranium comes from. And uh, we're right next door and on trend with two of the biggest uranium discoveries of the last decade. So there's a lot of a lot of good stuff happening in that neighborhood. And what's Saskatchewan like as a mining jurisdiction? Saskatchewan is, is really a great uh, jurisdiction to work in. They've been awarded some of the top places to be mine on the planet in the last few years. Uh, the, the government is hugely supportive. Uh, the people and services are, are fabulous. It's, uh, it's It's been a great a great place to work. Can you tell us a bit about financing? Are you planning to return to the capital markets soon? Well, financing is always tough in, in this world, in this field. Um, but uh, we've, been, we've been very fortunate the last year or so as we've seen uranium prices coming back. Uh, it's created a lot of excitement in the market, a lot of money, new money coming into uh, our sector. Uh, so it's allowed us over the last year or so to raise a significant amount of money, which we have. Uh, we're putting it to work right across the, the basin here behind us is a map. Anything in orange there is, is ours. And uh, the price of uranium has pretty much doubled in the last year or so, and uh, it needs to almost double again before we get to a, a price level that will allow new mines to open. So that incentive price is really something that, that we see the uranium price is moving towards rather rapidly now. And what are some catalysts that investors should be aware of going into, say, the next half of this year? In general or with PurePoint? With PurePoint. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, actually, again, like I say, we've, we've been able to get back to work. And uh, uh, in January, we were drilling at our Red Willow project and have uh, identified a, a massive region of, of, uh, of uranium mineralization. Uh, that we're now following up on. So we've, we've shuffled around our schedule. We're going to have uh, drills back out in September and following up on, on those discoveries out there. So we're hoping to see something pretty exciting coming. We're also uh, finishing up some prep work at our Hook Lake project in Camacon, Urbano. Uh, we think we've identified an area that, that we're all very excited about. We think it may be one of the one of the best prospects for a uh, tier one deposit in, in the basin. And uh, we, we are looking to be drilling that in January. So a lot of good work coming up, a lot of good information coming out, a lot of news flow, and, and, and we all the money to do it. So it's, it's really a good time right now. Lots to look forward to. Lots going on. Chris, what separates you as a junior mining company compared to other companies that we might even see here? Well, there's a lot of us here, yeah, and, and it's a pretty close-knit group. We all know each other quite well. Um, we, we swap sugar and stuff out in the woods. And uh, uh, in our case, you know, I think it's, it's, we have been, we've been uh, part of this community for, for many years now. We've got fabulous partners at Cameco and Arana. They're very supportive, not just financially, but they've, they've got some of the greatest technical uh, folks in the world working there. Um, and, and our projects are, you know, they're very well advanced. We've got a complete portfolio of projects right from early stage stuff right up to, you know, areas where we're starting to move into some, some big discoveries. So we're not a, a one-trick pony. We're not depend, throwing all our, uh, all our eggs in one basket. We've got uh, a lot of great projects. And any investors that are looking to get into uranium in general, it's, it's a solid play right now. Uh, there's a lot of upside in it, and uh, and of course we think we're one of the one of the favorite explorers out there right now as well. So it's uh, it's it's a good time to be looking at uranium and a good time to be looking at in uh, northern Saskatchewan. Chris Frosted of PurePoint Uranium, thank you so much for joining me today. Thank you.